I have a question about electric vehicles. Um, Ford said today it's delaying production on an electric SUV. Tesla earlier this week said that its sales are plunging. Do these types of developments make the administration rethink their EV policy? No, not at all. Look, um, you know, when it comes to EV sales, they are reaching record highs. Uh, EVs are more affordable than ever, and that's because of the work that this administration has done. Uh, last year, EV sales surpassed one million for the first time ever. That's a 50% increase. That matters. Under President Biden, EV sales have more than quadrupled. Sales of hybrids and EVs are now a record high of 18% of all light duty vehicle sales. Average price of an EV is down 20% from just a year ago, just one year ago. So we believe that this this is part of, well, I should say, the President has always said that he wants to make sure we do everything that we can to lower cost, lower prices. This is part of that. And also, do all, everything that we can to deal with uh, a climate crisis. And this is part of that. So is it realistic to go from about 7 or 8 percent of sales to 50 percent of sales in eight <coughs> years if the automakers themselves are cutting back on production? We believe, and we've seen that, that U.S. Manufa US manufacturing jobs have increased. Jobs have indeed increased. Uh, and when you see so a boom like this, that means you need auto workers, right? It can't happen on its own. Uh, and so we, uh, we believe this is working. We believe this is part of uh, what the President has promised. Uh, and uh, we want to see a manufacturing uh, industry that's for the future of this, of this country. And that's what we're seeing. And that's what the President's wor working and, towards. Uh, 